Hello everyone, welcome back to 7 Sense Talent Solution. Today let us see Genpack Off-Campus Drive for 2019, 2020 and 2021 batch students and how to apply for this opportunity. Before we get started, please subscribe our Telegram channel which is given in the description and also our YouTube channel. And if you like our YouTube videos, please press that like button and don't forget to share the video. Now let us see something about the company first. Genpack is a global professional service firm delivering digital transformation by putting digital and data to work to create competitive advantage. Genpack is reinventing and running thousands of processes for hundreds of clients. Many of them are global fortune 500 companies driving real world transformation at scale. Genpack expertise in combining end to end operations and AI based platforms Genpack Cora to focus on the details. Genpack began in 1997 as a business unit within General Electric. In January 2005, Genpack became an independent company to bring out process expertise and unique DNA in the lean management to clients with 90,000 plus employees and annual revenue of $3.7 billion as of December 31st, 2020. Okay, this is about the company guys. Coming to the next one, coming to the eligible criteria. Eligible branches are BEP Tech, BCA or MCA or any equivalent field can apply for this opportunity. Okay. Cutoff will be around 60% of 6.5 CGPA throughout your academics and there should be no active backlogs and it's for 2019, 2020 and 2021 batch students. Okay. Coming to the next one, coming to the job position guys, I will be a management trainee developer. Our location will be in Noida. The salary will be around 4 LPA to 7 LPA. Coming to the skills desired in a candidate. I uh, should have knowledge or experience in web and uh, windows based applications such as design code and test C, .NET framework, TFS, ASP.NET applications, a VB scripting skills that is visual basic scripting skills, good knowledge of SQL server 2008 and above, good to have knowledge of SSRS and SSIS, good communication skills and a team player, eye on execution and ownership. Knowledge of cloud technologies like MS Azure, Salesforce or Force.com. Knowledge of web services, MS Web APIs and uh, REST architecture. Okay guys, this is about the skills desired in a candidate that the company is looking. Coming to the next one, coming to the job description. I will develop, enhance and write code for software applications and, and components. Uh, stick to and uh, promote the team to use version control and coding best practices. Maintaining existing software systems by identifying and correcting software defects. Ability to face clients. Orientation towards business requirements. Investigate and develop skills in new technologies. Create technical specification and unit test plans. A boundary less in approach to work. Okay, that was your job description guys. Coming to the next one, rounds of selection. You will have around 4 rounds. In the first round, you will have online or written test. Questions will be on logic. Quant, verbal, and technical sections will be given. It will be around 58 questions approx. There will be no negative marking. It will be a moderate round. And after that, you will have GD round. Candidates are given topics and need to discuss about it on the spot. They will check your communication skills, your personality, your thinking ability. Okay, it will be an easy round. Then after that, you will have technical interview round. Questions will be on data structures, OOPS concept, HTML and JavaScript, SQL, a .NET, and uh, other technical points mentioned in your resume. Okay, it will be a tough round, so be prepared. After that, you will have HR interview. They will ask questions on your qualifications, experience, industry specific experience, courses done, your strengths and weaknesses, salary expectations, friends and family, etc. It will be an easy round. Okay. Moving on, coming to the next one. How to apply for this opportunity, guys? A registration link, this sort of will be given in the description. Please click on it. I will show you how you can apply for this opportunity. Okay guys, after clicking on the link, you will be taken to this one, where you can check the information that I told you before. Okay, all the information are given here. If you want to apply for this opportunity, please click on this apply. Then after that, uh, there is a job applicant privacy notice. Read it and you can accept it. Then after that, you need to register for this. Okay, if you already registered, you can log in. If you are a new user, please uh, click on register and you can register. Okay guys, after logging in, you will be taken to this one. First, you need to upload your resume. Okay, you can also upload your resume 
application using your LinkedIn account if you have or you can upload your resume separately choose file here first you need to select this select the resume file to upload then you can uh, choose your file okay then you can press on save and continue okay guys after that you need to enter your personal information enter your name last name your uh, email address what's your phone number were you ever employed by genpack no if yes you can enter yes next is the employee number employee number is the, it's for the persons who have been employed by the genpack earlier if not you can enter your register number here okay then now uh, what's your area of interest okay you can select it from here engineering you can also select multiple values by pressing on control okay then after that enter your country a state okay region or city what are the language do you know okay then what are the skills do you know okay it's mandatory you need to add one of the skills okay and uh, what's your uh, proficiency in that skill then after that you can uh, press on save and continue here you can review your uh, application if you want to edit you can press on edit or you can press on here you can go back okay uh, this is your application you can uh, if you press on submit button uh, your application will be submitted then you will get a notification that your application has been submitted thank you for your submission okay guys this was it thank you if you have any queries please comment down in the comment section i would like to add one more thing we have a different placement opportunities for the different price range in our website please check that out the link will be shared in the description where you can have company specific test training and a minimum of 50 placement opportunity okay guys the link will be shared in the description thank you guys signing off